And we're underway. The final match for this round of Super W 2023. It is Vigiana and Drua up against the Western Force over in Perth. Yes. Just the experience, the fact that you have a season and you can work out what works well with your team, what doesn't work well, and you can implement that next year moving forward. And we see short arm going against the Western Force. That throw wasn't meant to be. Yeah, playing advantage. And they've Never gone back. quickly. This is the kind of prowess we'd expect from the Indrua. They don't want to let their opposition take a breath and get to the set piece. Three offloads later, they're up on the Western Force 22. What a play from the Indrua. A pick and go here from Tawake. Gets it off nicely for Ailumu. Now they're coming across the space. And here it is, her third try for 2023. Lavenia Tinai is over. Indrua in the lead. Incredible try there from tonight. Talked about and drew what they do best, able to score from anywhere on the field. And it's been really polarizing, isn't it? When the Western Force have been successful in this opening 10 minutes, it's been structured play, lots of set piece, getting penalties in the breakdown. But then the Andrua, in the blink of an eye, they've gone from the end of one end of the field to the other, about four or five offloads, and they give it to a superstar like Lavinia Tinai to grab some points. Fell. Inside ball, finds Mattaelli looking for work off her wing. Back to the short side they go. Here it is with Duilepa. Back for Mattaelli, quick pass away for Miles and she's in. It's all tied up here at the library. A scoring demolition runner, Mattaelli, selflessly puts up the... Ball's there, nine years. Fell. Pleading her case with referee Kaminsky to no avail. Hirahirangi, Pomare. Pomare can't escape the iron claw grips of Milania. Malcolm Heke. Great Ball work there. from the hooker. Ball's there. And Drua, we're not seeing a lot of effort to roll away, but it's still with the Western Forces. No, the face count her, increases. Hirahirangi has a crack there at the five meter mark. Out to the left. Ashuagi gets some support. They keep marching forward. The pass from Tipa. Another cut out. Here it is with Wiggly. She's got options on the left. They get the ball to Mattelli. And she's in. Another fantastic team try from the Western Force. They were building that pressure. It was bound to happen. Same two players, Wiggly and Mattelli, linking up again. Great team effort. Did you see Lettington floats one over to the youngster Wiggly. Wiggly, just see there, holds onto the ball, but does the right thing, squares up these defenders, turns them inside out. Why Sanger looks for the offload, doesn't need it right away, still rumbling forward is the loose forward. Why Sanger over to the left. Players for days, here they come, the Andrua, and it's a double for Tinai. But this here, where it's so hard to defend, overlap of numbers. Add some mass, add some power. Keep them competitive and stop bleeding penalties at scrum time, but it won't help them. As the big blue machine continues to truck on forward. Right in front, Lettington. Finds the flags for the first time today and Western Force take the lead, 13 points to 10. She'll be looking to have an immediate impact here. Put some pressure on Fell as we see Ravatundi coming off the back. Meter away and now players coming around the corner for the Western Force. Here it is with Tipa. Tipa! She's over and the Force go further ahead. Team from the Western Force. I think in years past, we wouldn't have seen them stay that composed. It is full time. And with that, it is a big win for the Western Force. They've downed the Drua and kept themselves in the hunt for a finals berth in 2023.